Justice Nyako's partiality exposed as Supreme Court move to reclaim Namdekano's freedom declared in 2022. Correct. Which um, court can be higher than the Supreme Court? Already the Supreme Court have found Namdekano not guilty and have declared him free of all allegations levied against him. So why then are they still keeping him in detention? See that. So now the partiality and the you know the deceit of Justice Nyako has finally been detected. So the um the Supreme Court has now decided to come to the aid of the IPOP leader, you know, and fight for his freedom. Let's quickly check the content. This is today's news. A lawyer, Aloy H. Mako, who represents the embattled leader of the indigenous people of the Afra IPOP, Namdekano, says he has never doubted the partiality of Justice Bintat Nyako in the suit regarding his client. H. Mako, however, said the Supreme Court thinks otherwise. He made the submission on Tuesday while speaking at the Federal High Court in Abuja in the case involving the embattled IPOP leader who is facing charges bordering on treasonable felony. The lawyer said he and his team members didn't want to moody the waters so they didn't mention the supreme court's position on revoking canon's bail we have never doubted your partiality but the supreme court did we don't want to rub it on your face we wanted the court to apply it fresh discretion and that's why we did not bring up the apex court position on the revoking of his bill. H. Marco said to Justice Nyako. Meanwhile, as earlier reported, the IPOP leader has again been denied bail. Okay. Um there is no there is no time wasting, Ejimako. There's no time to waste. Why? Because even Justice Bintanyako herself knows that she is trading on a very, very dangerous path. She knows. And that's why she um is doing what she is doing but if you take the move and get the apex court that already granted Namdekan the freedom at first then justice pinta nyako will have no uh, no option than to surrender so you can go on and appeal for the freedom of Namdekano since already he has been granted. The time is now. The Supreme Court needs to intervene on this. Maybe the Supreme Court is just waiting. They are just waiting patiently to see what you will do. That's how I feel. Yes. You understand so um it's becoming um it's becoming tough by the day 
but we just just don't need to fold our hands and watch before anything begin to go wrong okay so dear listeners listening to this very broadcast it's been wonderful having you um thank you for giving us your able listening ear. it's been awesome thank you so much um let's quickly 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 um hear from you and then let us know how you feel about this don't forget to click on the red subscribe buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you